So my name is Lynn Henry. I am a breast medical oncologist at the University of Michigan and focus primarily on breast cancer as well as survivorship and quality of life in patients with cancer. You know, this year's ASCO had a lot of different uh, topics related to survivorship, both in the early stage cancer setting as well as in the metastatic setting. I think that the ones that stood out to me the most uh, were related to treatments for cancer-related fatigue. Um, there were a number of things that were studied, including yoga, uh, cognitive behavioral therapy for insomnia, as well as something as simple as walking dose, uh, which really were shown to be helpful for reducing cancer-related fatigue. You know, in particular, uh, hatha yoga and restorative yoga um, or cognitive behavioral therapy for insomnia were helpful for women who were about two years out from their breast cancer diagnosis. About three quarters of the patients had breast cancer um, and showed a su substantial improvement in uh, both insomnia and fatigue over time. You know, the other study was really looking at how much do you need to walk during chemotherapy to see an improvement in, in fatigue. And for women who would do very slow walking, um, it was about two and a half to four and a half hours per week, uh, which is seems like a lot, but actually when you divide it over a week, it's not that bad. And then if you do more moderate walking speed, um, you only had to do 0.7 to 2.2 hours per week. So, you know, I think those are very um, easily attainable and um, accessible um, interventions for patients um, that hopefully will make them feel a lot better, both while they're going through treatment and beyond.